Hello to everybody. Today I am talking about Venus as a dominant planet in your natal chart and how you can discover that Venus is a dominant planet due to your vocational path. So when you look on your natal chart for potential careers and how successful you might be, you may find planets placed in the 2nd, 6th or 10th houses or aspected with mid-heaven. Planets in these vocational sectors are the strongest career factor and usually one or two of these planets will be the dominant influence. So let's see what it means uh, dominant. If it's conjunction with mid-heaven, within 10th degree with the 10th or 9th house if it's in on the highest score i will uh, put the scoring rules on the description of this vlog if it's the square trine or opposite with midheaven if it's one of the most aspected planet in the chart and it's if if it's a career oriented earth sign Taurus, Virgo or Capricorn. Let's suppose that the Venus is your dominant planet due to career path. In this case you might be a Venusian type, depending on sign, house and aspects to other pl planets. You can focus on relating, loving, sharing and being intimate and making yourself and your surroundings beautiful and harmonious. The potential that Venus at its best in your career is to have excellent social skills in your career, a goodwill ambassador, public relation person, uh, to make a good networking, good team member, team player, promoting harmony and cooperation. You may have artistic skills, good design and style sense can create appealing graphics for promotional materials or any kind of artistic skills and talents. Which are the possible deficits? Uh, inappropriate flirtation or affairs with your boss, with your co-workers, or with the clients of the business, or with the many multilateral <laughs> uh, people uh, that will detract from the career focus or will complicate your vocational path with a lot of scandals and so on. And of course, uh, the other uh, consequences of this deficit, it's about that you will have affected your financial status about your money here yeah seeking constant approval and affection as payback for taking part in the career bending over backwards to get along and submerging your own needs which are the constructive traits of venus you are sociable charming attractive warm adaptable harmonious affectionate, likable, agreeable, good person skills, team player, able to compromise in a common sense compromise, not to, to become, a, you know, a servant, a slave actually. Which are the Venus possible difficult traits? People pleasure, overly concerned with appearances, coasting on charm rather than effort, vain, insincere, indolent, hedonistic, greedy, and superficial. How to fix uh, these difficult traits? Get a new hairstyle or a makeover. Buy a becoming new outfit or swap accessories or jewelry with someone whose taste you like. Buy flowers or grow some. Call someone you haven't talked to in a long time who adores you. Shred a date night with your mate or do something special with your best friends. 
I'm putting uh, below the score of uh, Venus and you might know like this. If the score is between 0 and 15, uh, the score is low. If it's between 16 and 25, it's moderate. If it's between 26 and 40, it's strong. You are too restless. And over 50, you are from another planet, maybe from Venus. Next month, I will talk about Jupiter as a dominant planet in your career path. Have a nice day. Bye.